Hey guys, Trucks Pop Games here showing you some simple yo yo tricks with the new trick yo yo I just got. Oh, yeah, I like my new style, the headband. Pretty cool, I think. Don't hate. Haters gonna hate. So I have this cool trick yo yo N5. So it's pretty good. I recorded sleep time, it's about six minutes, which is really good for a yo yo. These are really easy, easy beginner yo-yo tricks that you guys could probably all do because they're just that simple. So the first one you're going to start with a sleep, which is that, and you're going to want to grab it like halfway or a quarter of the way down to your preference. I like half, and then you're going to take your throw hand, loop it back down, so it makes sort of like weird triangle-ish thing and then you're gonna loop your non-throw hand back down which makes like a triangle I did that wrong but you can see it right now I'll try and show you it right just after I explain one more time so again halfway down loop your throw hand back around and then, yeah, I'll just show you. Sleeper, throw it, I like halfway. So you take your throw hand again, loop it back down, makes a triangle. Loop it back around like that. And if you need to tighten the triangle, look, this is a good one. And then you just sort of keep pushing it back and in, which looks cool. It will definitely impress your friends. I'll explain it one more time. I'll explain each trick three times. Sleeper, pinch it about halfway down, my preference. Make a triangle with your throw hand, loop it back down, make it bigger if you need, smaller if you need, and then just throw it back around as many times as you want. Impress your friends. Now we're going to do, this is probably even easier, but it, you don't even need the yo-yo. You just need the string, practically. So you're just going to, you're just going to stop your yo-yo completely. Then just let it go down. So you're going you're gonna to take your non-throw hand and put three fingers about here, like a quarter of the way down, and grip them. And then bring your throw hand down. Then bring your throw hand down back to the string, just like the pendulum, like that triangle. Then you're going to grab the string with your three fingers, and it's going to make a triangle. And then you're going to point these fingers to the direction your head is looking at. So mine's looking that way, so I point my fingers. And then grab it, and I take my pinky. So it's, it should look like this, and then I take my pinky, pull it. And then boom, it's the Jamaican flag. Again, your non throw hand three fingers, grip it to here. Your throw hand three fingers, grip it to here. It has a triangle. Then you're gonna, with your non throw hand, point to the direction your head's facing, grab it, should look like that, and then pinky, pull it over. One last time for you guys. Non throw hand, Grip with three fingers, throw hand, grip with three fingers, point to the direction your head is facing, grab it, pinky, boom, make them fly. Next one, you also don't want your yo-yo going. This one is a bit harder than the Jamaican flag, but still pretty easy. So you want to gonna you're gonna form an L like this with your fingers, and then you're gonna take your non-throw hand and pull it through, then here, oh, you guys might have not saw that. Pull it all the way through. Gonna put your whole hand inside it. Grab this string right here. Pull it in. So it should look like this weird. It doesn't look like the Eiffel Tower. But then when you put, so it should look like this. And then you put, take your throw hand and then just grab the string. And then you just pull it to the length you want. 
So boom. Eiffel Tower. Again, slingshot. Pull it through. Put your whole hand through. Grab the string. Pull it through. Throw hand. Loops around. Grabs it. Eiffel Tower. Last time. Boom. Slingshot. Whole hand through. Grab. Finger loops around. Eiffel Tower. Alright, so this one. This one is the hard, definitely the hardest. For me, I can't do it. I can only do beginner tricks, really. Like, some really good people, I asked my friends at school, they said, like, half of them say it, it's an intermediate, and half of them say it's a beginner. So, you're gonna want to throw a breakaway, which is like flexing, and then you throw a sleep, and then it should spin this way, not this way. Spin this way and not this way. But if you can't do that, you're gonna you're gonna want to throw a sleeper and then just stand aside it like this, which is what you can do. But learning breakaway is good, or you could throw a breakaway however you want. It doesn't really matter. But for the sake of the video, a lot of beginners are probably watching, so I'm gonna throw a sleeper and then stand beside it like this. All right, so you're gonna want to throw a sleeper like this. Then you're gonna to want to stand beside it, like I was saying. Then you're gonna take your the back of your hand and put it here to the side you're facing. Then your throw hand string is gonna loop loop around the thumb. So again, it's like this. And you're gonna want to like a gun. You're gonna make like a gun like this. A gun. Loop it around the thumb. And then the finger. And then once you have this, you should see the string that's actually on the yo-yo, like closest to it. So it should look like this. And the string that's around the thumb, so this one, you're going to want to pull that out like this, how far you want. And then you wanna, you're going to want to swing the yo-yo and catch it on this middle string. So that one's pretty hard. I will try it at my third attempt, but right now I'm just explaining. Let me wrap this up quick, quickly. Okay, so sleeper, stand beside it. Back hand, they make a gun, loop it around both fingers, pull this thing, boom, you have your thing, or you might want it a bit higher and then you swing it on. Now here comes the real attempt. I've never, I've never, I've landed it on the middle string, but then I can't fish it back out. And if you land it on the middle string and don't fish it back out, it doesn't count. So here we go. You put back in around the gun here. Start pulling it out. Here we go. Oh, oh, I did it, but didn't pull it out. So. I'm going to do a recap on all of the tricks, and then this video will be wrapped up. Sorry for not posting in forever. I've been really busy with school and stuff. So yeah, just almost summer. Well, here. It's almost summer over here. Wherever you guys live, comment down below where you live and what time of year it is. So, recap of all of them. First one, pendulum. You're gonna throw a sleeper, put it halfway down, your preference, put your throw hand back into a triangle, loop it, oops, loop it back around, make it bigger or smaller, whatever you need, and then just boom, easy. And these will all definitely impress your friends. Next one, throw another sleeper, Three fingers, grip, uh, straight, three fingers, grip, triangle, point to where your head's facing, grab it, pinky, grab it, boom, oh crap, there we go, Eiffel Tower.
tower now. Sleeper. Pull the slingshot. Put your whole hand through it. Grip this string. Loop it around and then make it bigger, smaller, whatever. Boom. And then fill the bucket. Whoa. Had a knot in it. Fill the bucket. Throw a sleeper. Oh gosh, what? Hmm. Sorry about that. Throw a sleeper. Stand aside. Backhand. Loop it around the thumb end. Punky finger. Take this string that's looped around the thumb. Pull it. Land it in. And then throw it back out. Just, if you guys didn't see that, I did not just do that trick. So, you all impress, you all impress your friends with all those tricks. Hope you learned something new today. Goodbye.